near the, near the airport. Some lady comes up and goes, Do you have a that's great, because the park's usually don't allow that. All right, that was Mark. Christmas. Sorry, there's a little technical difficulty there. But, you know, um, the, the thing is, what, what a lot of filmmakers, my, you know, myself included, what we go through, you know, sometimes we don't have the... Well, none of, none of us filmmakers have the budget of Hollywood, but none of us are going to turn out the Avengers, you know? So it's like, it doesn't matter it's like as long as you have a good story. Money, use the good story. Or whatever camera you have. Uh, I say something like my partner, Tim Rader, he goes, you do the best with what you can with what you can. You get a Super 8 movie camera, you want to make a movie, take your Super 8 camera, go make a movie. You got a red camera, you got a you got a you got a you got a you make a movie, you know, it's, you know, 8, 8 millimeter, whatever, make yourself a movie for hundred dollars so people can see it. Don't sit around and go, I'm going to wait until I have a quarter of a million dollars in my bank account, and then I'll buy a camera, and, and, and the production, you know, and you can if you want, but... <laughs> Never uh, next up, we have a, uh, and I think Rick Danford is actually in the booth, so I don't know if he can come up. But uh, uh, Rick Danford's short, it's called The Thing Under the Bed, it's pretty neat though. Rick Danford brought Chuck Norris in for this to make an appearance in it, which is really, really cool. And he had a budget of a quarter of a million dollars for this. And uh, it's coming up next. This is uh, The Thing Under the Bed by Rick Danford. <laughs> Oh, there's Marcus. I'm sorry to know 